All right, the Bucks returned to practice for the first time since their big win in Munich, Germany and Tampa Bay. They're now 5-5 five and five this season, holding a half-game lead over Atlanta in the NFC South. And our own Kevin Lewis catching up with the team today as they try to keep that winning streak going. Despite being back for more than a week, Bucks players are still buzzing over their historic win in front of a rowdy German crowd. It was electric, man. Like, no matter who had the ball or where it was at, anytime it got kicked, it got louder. But uh, no matter who had the ball, everybody was standing up, getting loud. Like, it was so energetic around. It was, it's crazy to play in something like that because, like, it was no way to say, all right, the momentum shifted here or there because it was rolling the whole night. Bucks rookie running back Rashad White had more carry on luggage to haul back. The NFL Network gave him their angry run scepter for this third quarter stiff arm display. I'm a very even kill guy, so like my person was kind of like it just it was just like a play like to me. Uh, but then everybody, you know, excited, excited, and uh, it was a good way to get the team kind of rallied up and fired up. Uh, as I could see from uh, my teammates, the guys' reaction, so uh, it was pretty smooth to, for it to be like that. The rookie's getting more and more touches, and says he feels more and more comfortable in the Bucks' offense. My confidence is at an all-time high, um, but uh, you know it just comes along with it. Uh, just knowing your job, doing your job. The things I can control is my attitude and my effort. And when I play, that's what I control. White said he didn't know if he was going to stay in the starters role like he was against Seattle, but said he wanted his teammate Leonard Fournette to get healthy so they can keep opponents on their heels with a multi-back attack. The Bucks play at Cleveland on Sunday. In Tampa, I'm Kevin Lewis, ABC Action News.